Enrico Mignanella to stop the clock at 55 seconds. Third personal on Enrico. You see the... Uh, the Pier, yes, the Pierpoos fans are standing on their feet. Yeah, you can understand why. And again, uh, you notice the, uh, the letters on the shirt. Shirts of the Pierpoos of Greece uh, ET. That, of course, uh, is for Eugene Tejada, their fallen teammate. And it also means, uh, according to Richard Del Rosario, ends tonight. And the Kirby makes both. Well, 27 points in the game for Kirby Ramundo. Coming up big, big here. Big nice for Kirby. Larry Penasher gets it over to Serena Cruz. Serena Cruz trying to check three. Enrico Villanueva back to Serena Cruz. Serena Cruz gets it over to Lordi Tugato. Three points out by Lordi from the Nick Tunisi underneath. Scores in the reverse left. 39 seconds to go. That is an eight point lead by Pierre Cruz. 39 seconds to go. Eight point lead by the Pierre Cruz Chucky Giants. This timeout. Exclusively on Pinoy Central TV. With two minutes in the game, or left in the game, James up. Let's go with Jeff shot and makes it to make it 84-77. To give here for a seven point lead with two minutes to go. Right now, 39 seconds remaining, they have an eight point lead and possession of the leather. You have to love the substitution by Coach Ryan Gregorio bringing Jude Lipford back in yeah. the game. And after 14 years, Jude Lipford with a chance to win a championship here. Uh, this is going to be ultra sweet. By the way, Jun Limpot, he has waited so long. How about Coach Ryan? It's been four years since he won his first championship. 2002, That's yes. right, the Pure Foods management has had a lot of confidence in him. He's done a great job this year. And here's Jun Limpot uh, and his search of the first CBA title. And age 34, played for LaSalle. And Takasurikao, yeah, Marajau, Lebihum, Sein Jutanan, Susurikao. Number one pick in the 1993 draft. He was rookie of the year and has played for three teams. Never won a championship. The best player never to have won a championship. Jim Laporte at the line. This is that one. He was actually known for his big deal. You know? Yeah. He was big deal financially when he signed, but he missed that first foul shot, but he has a chance now to further this lead for his team. You have to feel happy with Jim Lipot. Well, that boy, you ends tonight, and it looks that way, as Lipot makes one of two. Cyrus Bakio, looking for Lordi Tugade. Tugade is trying to weave inside, and comes up with a layup with 22 seconds to go. And it's a second-point lead here by Pierre Cruz. James Yap, and then coming out with a confetti. The confetti has come down here. The game's not over yet. Not yet. 12 seconds to go. And James Yap is hanging on to the leather. And the retro players are not uh, going after it. Hugh uh, Foods wins the 2006 Philippine Cup by seven points over Red Bull at 1983. Big win here by the Pierpoods, Chucky Giants, Coach Norman. Well, congratulations to Coach Jim Ryan Lippert. Gregorio. Jim Lippert is getting a victory ride. That's correct. He should get one. As we said, it's got a taste of the sweet here. But I mean, Jim Lippert, we have Coach Ryan Gregorio. And what a great year for the Chucky Giants, losing the first conference to Red Bull, getting back at Red Bull in this particular conference and pulling off the championship. And the Fedbetti is raining down pompously here at the uh, Araneta Coliseum. As we know, tears of joy are also streaming down the faces of a lot of Fairbridge players, fans, and this Chris Aquino very demurely applauding the Fairbridge team, which he has supported in a big way. All throughout this campaign. Well, I think Pure Foods just willed themselves to a victory here for the championship. 
everybody thought Red Bull would have the advantage going into this championship, but instead, Pier Blue controlled the series throughout. Chris Aquino continues to get the camera time here. Oh, <laughs> and uh, well, we all know that. Uh, as you said, that Pure Foods uh, not only wanted to take revenge on Red Bull, which denied them a championship in the Fiesta Conference, but also wanted to win big. And they started off really rolling and smoking here, took a 3-1 lead in the series. A Red Bull denied them a win in game number five just a couple of nights ago. But tonight... Uh, Pedro Raimundo et al. made sure that there would be no Game 7. And, uh, well, Coach Ryan always said if he could just keep his team healthy, he could win a championship. Yes. And his team has been healthy for the most part. 